What'd you say, bro? Apps or gear? What should we start with? I say probably gear because y'all I've been, the thing with the Lo-Fi Six, and I've been noticing that one is even doper for resampling because you got more time. They give you 15 pads, which that's it. it. Uh, bro, it kills I mean. me. Oh man, I <laughs> used the CME with the MPC, even though yeah. it has Bluetooth built in. Did they add anything? Yeah, remember like in the retro color, the retro color way, and then Devil Ram. People yeah. use the quick sampler, but so a lot it of it doesn't people... necessarily work the same way as every other door. It's non-linear. Like it's, it's all. Yeah, yeah, Koala. The, uh, oh, the, no, it, it ain't the, the, the update. update. Koala, We've had you know a saying? few weeks of updates. Z Maker 3 came out with an update. So we have our man Carlton and Nurse Wilson in the crib. Let's go ahead and give everybody a little bit of background of where you guys started the music, man. What get you? What oh. got you started in the music? <laughs> uh, <laughs> being in uh, the lunchroom with you. <laughs> in high school <laughs> that is where like it got serious for me um started there and then just started putting beats online and that uh, things just progressed from there and just kept it moving from there but that's where yeah. i got started was in the lunchroom that's yeah good, yeah uh, i was right there to uh, witness i know you was doing the beatboxing <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah it was good times too man because uh when you started making beats you know we was in high school i think when, when yeah. we linked up i was a sophomore you was a freshman yeah. Well, you still had the flat top. You know? <laughs> <laughs> I remember that. <laughs> and uh, you used to uh, play some of your beats through the Walkman back in the day. Oh, wow. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I, on the disc band. That rings bring a bell. On the school bus, and we would be in the back of the bus. I'm like, man, these is, these is fire. Yeah, brother. We're back. <laughs> We're back. <laughs> Dude, what up, what up, what up, world? It's Resimple, really everything. It's Beat Makers and Squad. It's Dragonfly, bro. Micro Mix Studio. Shouts to J1 Star, aka. Wait, what's his, what's his new tag? Shadow the, Bear, I Shadow think. Shadow Bear, yeah. Shadow Bear. Oh, damn. Sha Shouts, shouts to the homie Cypher Omni, aka Cypher Omani. <laughs> yeah, I'm taking it Cypher back. Get money. Yeah, yeah, we back, we back. So, um, what's good, Joe? How y'all been? Chilling, chilling. How you been? Everything's good. That's what's up. for a new season, y'all. Yeah, yeah, season yeah. four, right? We're on four? Yeah. Damn, I didn't yeah. even know. We're on I, four. I, I, just, I, just, I just be showing up. I don't count. Yeah. <laughs> we nah, took a little break. Dope. You know, everyone needs a little break. Yeah, Let yeah, you guys yeah. miss us a little bit. But we back. Yeah. Back. We never left. <laughs> and yeah. Today, we got a lot of apps to talk about because a lot of, and gear, a lot of things yes. dropped. Yes. But before we get into that, we got a new layout, so stay tuned. We're going to be giving tutorials and lessons and reviews right on the show. Um, so, yeah, first thing that came out while we were gone, uh, you want to get into apps or gear? Um, what'd you say, bro? Apps or gear? What should we start with? I say probably gear because y'all probably have a lot more apps and gear. You probably can knock the gear out quick, huh? Well, YouTube been, been buying everything up, so I don't know. Hey. I'm on mm -hmm. hiatus. I'm not buying shit no more. <laughs> only thing I bought was the only, only thing I bought was them low fives. <laughs> the the uh, the uh, the Sonic, Sonic Wear, the low right? Five twelve. I got the low five six yeah. as well. That low five twelve. I, I I love it. Oh my god, I love it. I love it so much. The the six. I love it too. I just haven't really like figured out how to get. I haven't figured out how to get it to sound the way I want it to sound, or just to figure out how exactly how it will sound you know what i mean like you know how like some of these mm -hmm. some of these joints do what they do what they want to do and we and not what we want them to do so yeah, like, yeah. i'm still in that mm -hmm. phase with it but like but, but what is the, the difference joints, between the 12 and the 6. the 6 is uh lower fire oh. <laughs> <laughs> i was gonna say no dollars though they're both the same price though right uh i think i don't know i think i think the it's like 249 no, I think the low five six might have been two ninety nine. Ah, okay, yeah, okay, because like, limited edition now. I guess I don't know. It, it's it's limited edition, but it's been on sale for like two months. Like, unless it's not selling really well, because they said it was only five hundred units or whatever. Hmm. So I mean, I don't know. Like, I, I I I'm not sure, but I know I know when as soon as I saw it, I was like, oh no, because it, just because how dope the low five twelve is. I was like, nah, I'm. I don't even care. Like, I'm just, I'm just getting this. And and when I seen the 500 unit, I was like, oh well, let me jump and get it like quick. But like, <clears throat> I obviously could have waited. But um, it's dope. The um, the sound quality between the two is different though. Like, so the mm. um, 
Lo-Fi 12 records, I think, at like, it's, it's supposed to, it's, they have a 12 bit button, but um, it's at like um, 20, 24, two, for, yeah, 24, yeah, yeah, 22 20, or 24 hertz or something like yeah, that. Yeah, and the, um, and the other, and the Lo-Fi 6 is at like 6 hertz or something like that, or something. It's something, something Killer crazy. Hertz, sure. yeah, yeah, it's like, yeah. it's super dirty. Um, mm. and, um, and, uh, they, it's, so they got rid of the 12 bit button on the low five six and they put a, um, a tube saturator button on it. Um, and so, uh, and so just like with the low five 12, when you turn it, turn the low, when you turn the 12 bit on, like, I don't know about anybody else, but I don't really hear like a, a massive difference or anything like that with the mm. tube. You don't hear like a huge difference until you start, you got all four tracks going and they, um, and they pretty loud. That's when the um, that's when you actually start hearing that tube start doing a little bit more, but um, the Lo-Fi Six it's a lot more bass heavy, and so they got an um, exciter on there that actually brings the high frequencies back into the sample. It's pretty dope. Like it, like you can get you can make it sound real like real like trashy but good at the same time mm. if, if if you get what I mean. Um, yeah. But it, it, it's real dope. It's real dope. You know what I mean. And it has um, double the sample time of the Lo-Fi 12. But all the samples are mono. Like Lo-Fi 12, you can sample in stereo or mono. This one, you only sampling in mono. So wait, really? Yeah. It's a stereo samples on on the 12? Yeah, you know that, bro. Oh my god. Yeah. Cuz I I th I'm pretty sure you sample you could do a stereo or mono and if you do it mono, you know, it, it gives you more time, I think. Oh, I probably Oh, I probably keep it on the, It's 4 seconds on on mono though, right? I think it's 4 it seconds on stereo. Oh, damn. I need to, I need to Which one you got, bro? You got the 12, right? I got it. Yeah, yeah, I got the 12. So like the 6, I definitely wanted the 6, but um yeah, the 12, man. It's like after I had that, it's like I think I can make it work. Yeah, it's 24 hertz, 24 mm -hmm. kilohertz on the sample. Um, but yeah, yeah, I mean, it's a good box. So like for me, it's like m me cheating getting a, uh, a SP1200 or like a SP12 or a Turbo or any of those EMU units to ross them. I'm not gonna pay the dollars, yo. I'm gonna tell you that straight out. Like, I mean, as far as hardware goes, like I got plenty and it's like, I'm actually thinking about, about going like to more minimal on hardware in the future, but mm -hmm. um. I love the sound, man, and, and this box does it. Like yeah. When I heard the demos, I was like, oh, yeah, this is it. And then after you got your hands on it, Facts. it doesn't take long to figure out, like, oh, this is the grits in the box. It's not even necessarily what you, you know. Mm -hmm. After you put anything in there, it comes out pretty gritty. And you're like, oh, yeah, that's exactly what I'm looking for, you know. Yeah. And then adding the bass and the, the record, like um, the vinyl mode, mm -hmm. you know, you, you fluff it up the vinyl modes, and then you got pretty much your SB1200. Yep. Um, it's just a couple parallels. So, like, on the 1200, you have a roll button, but then on this one, you got a stutter button. Mm. That's right. Yeah, so, yeah. so you know, if you want to do the P rock, like if you're tracking the beat out and you want to do those little, you know, the snare pops and stuff like that, to you know, to the track while you're tracking it, it's just the different buttons, man. You can still map it out and get a lot of the same, yeah. same juice out of it. To say the truth, I mean, I'm not saying it a it a fool somebody that's a SP1200 head, but a, a lo-fi people will be like, okay, this is hard, and boom bap people will say, mm. okay, these 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 are hard. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, and, and and that four second sample time it forces you to speed them samples up, which gets you that grit anyway. You know what I mean? And uh, yeah. it, it, unless because and since when it first came out, people was like, oh, you can only do this, you can only do that, like, and it was like, damn, like you you not even giving it in a week. You know what I mean? Yeah, people yeah, like yeah. just making videos like, oh, you can only play four sounds. It's like no, like it, there's really like you because like people because it's a four track sequencer. And they were like, oh, I, I, I can put a kick on track one, a snare on track two, hi-hat on track three, and a sample. I don't have anywhere for the bass. It's like, bro, you don't even know how to use a machine. Like, you really don't even know how to use a machine. But, you know. But that's well, what we're going to do. We're going to get into though. it. You mm -hmm. guys are going to show well, us how to use the machine. Yeah, yeah, that's for sure. No, no, no. But on the, the first version, what? The, no, 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 on the first one, it didn't have the drum chop mode, though. No, it didn't have the drum chop mode, but you, remember, you put me on the para, you, like, yo. The, oh, oh, the, the, um, the parameter, parameter locks. locks. Yeah. yeah. You put me on. Like, yo. So yo, I stopped, crazy I stopped thing, using that chop mode, though. Crazy thing is Sonic where took yeah. what I said, parameter lock is your friend, and put it in yeah. their videos. I got that from you, bro. <laughs> 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 I got that from, yo, you was, yo, you hit me on, yo, bro, hit yeah. me on the side, was like, yo. You gotta turn that parameter lock on. Soon as yeah. soon as he told me that, soon yeah. we was out. 
because that's when you could like you parameter lock you that means you could lay down your kicks mm -hmm. on, on the same track as your snare mm -hmm. and and it's just all oh, this it's, it's a step sequencer you know what I mean? And so you, you can put a different sound at each step. And in each step, you could turn a knob and, and, and like adjust the filter or adjust this. You could adjust the sample start time. Like the joint is crazy. Like, and yeah, then when they, yeah. and then when they put the chop on it, forget about it. It the joint yeah. is done. Chop is killed. Dope. I mean, like after chop happened, I was like, this is the best box out. Now, if it had an SD card or like a USB, it, I mean, they could add like another, they could make it 500 bucks easy. Mm. You yeah. get like an XL version of this, put an mm -hmm. SD card on it and call it a day. I mean, you don't even have to make the sample time longer or nothing. Give me, I'll I, I take that and give me four outs. I, I pay $16 yeah. oh, yeah, for yeah, four yeah, outs. Yeah, yeah. I ain't gonna lie to you. Four outs and and removable media. Cause it, you don't even need that that much time. Cause it's because the way it sent it saves now is with the uh, the MIDI system exclusive files. Yeah. And them joints is what like not even a megabyte big or something like Pretty that. Floppy disk. Yeah. yeah, you could. I mean, you could, yeah, you could go. No. With a floppy yeah, disk. Yeah, no, no. Please don't put a floppy on it. Please. Sign <laughs> no, I'm saying like the size <laughs> of a floppy disk. Like, yeah. You, yeah. <laughs> nah. Yeah. But nah. But like, but 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 that's serious. Like the joint. Like if I like if I was. Um, if I was like just starting to make beats or something like that, and I had a very limited budget, you know what I'm saying? Like this is, and I and I wanted to do those type of beats, like the type of beats that sound kind of kind of dirty and gritty and stuff like that. I would, and and I and I wanted something that was going like kind of force me to be creative between this joint and something like Koala. Like between those two, forget about it. Like you 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 good money, absolutely mm. good money. What's the price you know? of it? Uh, I think the lo fi twelve is like two seventy nine, two twenty nine. Oh, so that's not bad. No, it's dumb cheap. Yeah, that's it's, it's not definitely bad cheap. At all. I mean, for what it is, it's like come on. So, so the plugins. So if you get the SP twelve hundred plugin, that's cheap. I mean, granted, it's just a piece of software, right? Mm -hmm. It doesn't do this. And then you said the magic words that forces you to be creative, right? Mm -hmm. Because like after you use the sequencer, you're like, okay, here's my, here's the ball, you know, here's the ball field, here's what I can play with, and then let's play inside of this field. Yeah. And then you could go crazy. And then this is so much stuff to do. And then parameter locks, I still do use them even with mm -hmm. chop mode, but for like effects and stuff like that, I'll put a, a, a echo on that one snare or, or, or mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? You could put that in the chain. And the crazy thing is now you can resample. Yeah. yeah, yeah. You can resample. You. So whatever's inside, you could resample whatever, like, <clears throat> so you could resample your, uh, your sequence. Like you, like say you, like what I, what I, what I was doing, I would, um, make like a drum loop. Right, I take I put make a drum loop with the first three tracks. Then track four, I will sample those first three tracks as my drum loop. Then clear tracks one through three, put my sample in, mm. put my bass in. Then I got a track for like the like the little effects that the you know type shit. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah. And and the next thing you know, you got a you got a joint. You know what I mean? Like and and, and I've been the thing with the lo-fi six, but I've been noticing that one is even doper for resampling because you got more time. You know what uh, I mean? And so you make so I, now I'm making like actual like uh, melodic sequences on it, mm -hmm. resampling it and then slowing it down. You know hey, what so I mean? Hey, so when you resample it, it goes right to the track, or you got to play it back on the track. So it goes. So the way I do it is mm -hmm. I I will I will use like if if you use all four all four tracks, whatever is the last track that you that you touch. Mm -hmm. um, the, the first sample on that track is going to be the one that is going to be overwritten, basically. Oh, okay. So, if, okay. so but, but if you only use three tracks and you're going to sample the track four, you mm -hmm. just choose a, a empty sample and then and then go to the resample and then boom. And what I what I usually do is like if if the if I'm resampling and the sample it falls right in time with the you know it's obviously going to fall right in time with the beat and I want it to play from like from from beat one and go through. I'm, I, I will actually sequence that before I even resample it. So uh, when yeah. it resamples and I hit yeah. press play, boom, yeah. it's already yeah, playing. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Damn, I want to see a video too, man. I can't wait. I did, I did a video on that. That's yeah. that because that was the one I was like dispelling myths about, mm. um, about 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 the thing. I think it was that one, and then when, and I think that was right when the um when the update when the update dropped because because yeah. uh you know people was like oh you can only play for it and i was like mm, mm, mm. you people don't know how to use this yeah. this machine myth number one multiple samples cannot be used on the same track okay so i'm going to sequence the snare here on steps five and 13 but before i do that i'm pressing the parameter button 
If it is orange, parameter lock is enabled. Okay, parameter lock is your friend. All right, so 513 corresponds to beats two and four, as you can hear. So now I'm going to change the sample in order to spell a myth that if you change the sample while you have a sample loaded on or a sequence on a track that it will change the sample on that track. Okay, so I'm going to sequence a kick into some empty steps. As you can hear, the kick and snare are playing on the same track. Okay, this is all due to parameter lock. Okay, parameter lock allows whatever step you have a sound programmed into for that step to basically be locked in. Whatever parameters are on that step will be locked in, hence the name parameter lock. So now I'm just gonna clear the sequence, okay? And remind you one more time that a parameter bar button is orange, parameter lock is on. Parameter lock is your friend. All right, now let's check out the resample option and the update. It's magic though, it's a magic box, man. I mean, it's, it's, dope. it's, it's yeah, 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 it's really it's good. It's dope. It, sound, it, it sounds, it sounds, it just, it, yo, it sounds like, like, 93. Mm. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> like, so ass. same company, sample track. It can sound it can sound closer to the Lo-Fi 12, but as far as like drum programming and shopping, the, the Lo-Fi 12 gets it. But if you want to add like guitar and bass, you know, like if you if you change it, change the sample track up to Lo-Fi 12, <laughs> then I can take my guitar and bass and plug them up. It has, we both um, have that too, right? That sample track. Yeah, we got both. I forgot mm -hmm. I had that one. <laughs> yeah. So then you got so you can sample one note on the sample track, right? And play that mm -hmm. like keyboards and have like a whole sequence running, kind of like Ableton Live. Like mm -hmm. sample track um, is like a uh, Ableton Live in the box. That's the best way to say it. Like you the can, clip, you can, um, the clip windows. You could do that one. You could do the one note and stretch it on the um, low files too. Like you know, you know what I mean? Because yeah, each, yeah. each 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 track, you basically mm -hmm. like can can do that. The the sample track, I'm not even gonna lie, like that one I used for a little while and I, I, I like then I put it in a in a case I bought and it's up on the shelf. Not cause I don't like it, but just cause like uh, uh it, when it first came out, like the workflow was real, real like wonky. And mm. I was like, eh. But I, I tell you this much, the little pads on there sound great. I mean sound, they feel great. And you can like say you, you chop your, your your sample up. They give you 15 pads, which that's it. it. Uh, bro, the hell that kills me. Oh man, there's only two things. That 15. I do 16 chops, so I'm like, where is my last chop? So I can't even yeah. finish a bar here. But uh, or you do eight chops, you know? Yeah, and then they. But it's. I think it's like seven on top, eight on the bottom, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. So, but but the dope the dope part about it is like, you can lay, you can put whatever chop on whatever pad you want. Yeah. So if you're a type of person who don't like to do chop one, two, three, four, you want to do chop one, chop eight, chop, you know, whatever the case may be, you could take your chops and just arrange them right there on it. So you can go straight across, but it's not playing this sample straight across. Mm. You know what I mean? Like, and, and you can just do that at, at, right after you chop it. Like, and, and it's, it's real dope. And considering it's like, it's, it's, it's mad small and it works as an audio interface. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> and like, and it's a, and it's a direct box for like, for uh, guitar, for bass, um, mm -hmm. and and uh, and like if you plug in like a um, was that a dynamic mic or whatever, like like yeah. it, it's like yo that 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 little box, like you can get busy with that box. I'm not even going, I'm not even going front. Yeah, they kind so of made both that them, you box can go crazy to be mobile. Mm -hmm. So like so so here's the thing. So the low five twelve, you could track those onto the sample track. You could sample, you could track four tracks onto the sample track, clear the mm -hmm. low five twelve, and make four more tracks. Mm. Oh Cause shit! Because sample track can take like what twelve tracks of audio, and then and then so those same ones you can even go to lo-fi mode on each track and then make it sound dirtier. Mm -hmm. So like I could I record guitar and bass, and then on that same same track I just go to the settings and I just say turn on lo-fi, and it turns my my live recording to twelve bit. Yeah, and and, and the, um not for nothing, what's this? I forget what effect it is, but they got an effect on that you throw on the drums. Uh, the, oh, the master bus compressor. I think so. It's a, yeah, it's a, it's a, uh, uh, it's two of them. Yeah. It'll have them drums slapping. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 it's true. Slapping All right, we're giving them too much. We're giving them too much. We're giving yeah. them too much. We got to show them. So in the next couple episodes, you guys are going to show them some videos on this. All right, what else came out? We have a whole bunch of NPCs that dropped. Ain't nothing really new about them. Yes, the NPC One Plus, the NPC X S E, mm -hmm. and then... That's it, right? Well, I'm lying. Yeah, OnePlus. There is a couple new things about the the um the OnePlus. 
Devil I memory? Um, no, no, I don't know about the memory. Bluetooth, I believe. <clears throat> Does the Listen, one have Bluetooth? No, it doesn't. However, right? Bluetooth sucks. I'm sorry. I, uh, I love it. I love it. I got the CME you don't with get it. Yes. With the, with, the M- about to say. with the MPC one, I don't never, I don't experience no latency. Mm. Like I, I got the CME with it. And the crazy thing is about the one plus, you can do MIDI out with the or MIDI. You, I know you, you can only the MIDI can only go one way with the um with with the uh with the. That's um, with the CME the plus, plus. The, the CME though. If, if somebody no. was trying to use Bluetooth without On that, actual MPC, you would get mad perfect, latency. Yeah. Yeah, it's not as nah. good. So I use the CME with the MPC, even though yeah. I have Bluetooth built in. Yeah, I use, I use the CME with the with the with the Bluetooth because I because I I use my iPad as like my iPad is basically my Triton and my MPC <laughs> one is the MPC and then I just plug the M the little the little MP the Damn, the little smart. um Akai keyboard play on that Damn, and like smart. literally like and 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 like literally I'm just same only thing about it is that like. <clears throat> The, the you know I'm, I gotta record like sounds like one track at a time mm-hmm. like if I you know if I wanna if I wanna yeah. separate them out into the MPC but like even still like like it's like I I can use that to um to sync it up with stuff like gadget or even beat maker right. three or whatever you know what I mean mm-hmm. wherever I got wherever I got the samples at you know so it's the so the when they when they dropped the one plus I was like oh it was dope it's red and I was like well, why don't you do that already <laughs> <laughs> oh man. I'm not getting fooled by none of the new NPCs. Yeah, I'm tired of Akai dropping fly ass designs after I already bought the damn machine. Yo. Because that's all I, I see go, is fly ass designs now. The inside I is the gonna same. I ain't going to hold you. I ain't going to hold you that, that MPC X. Yeah, I had that joint on back order uh <laughs> and then I, I i canceled that order I, and it wasn't it wasn't because i was like oh i got i don't want this uh, kai this uh, kai that i just i just got impatient i'm like mm-hmm. nah like if i'm I, like i'm like i got the mpc one like and and i and i like that joint. i just want a full-size mpc again that's it yeah, yeah. that's all it is you know what i mean yep because what does the uh the new x what is it the se yeah. it's called mm-hmm. There's nothing new, is there? Did they add Devil anything? Devil memory like and the retro color, the retro colorway, and then Devil RAM. And RAM, but yeah, I more, mean, as far as inputs memory. and outputs, there's nothing new, right? Damn, no, no, no. Yeah, no, I'm no. good. But I tell you what, it dropped the price of the original X down like about fifty percent. Fifty percent. But oh, yes, yeah, I think people are saying they're buying like, the X for like seven, eight hundred bucks. Oh, I ain't seen. I ain't nah. seen that. Price. Nah, I if bucks. I see that price, I'm gonna have, yeah, to, I'm gonna have to pull the trigger. I ain't gonna lie. I don't lie think because I. <laughs> Let me see. Yeah, check it out. Check it I out. See, I seen one yeah, this morning. Yeah. I just seen one this morning on eBay for like fifteen, sixteen hundred. You know. You might so, be right because right. remember they were twenty five when they came out. Mm-hmm. And I'm being oh, nice because I think it was sure, twenty seven. Yeah, 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 they definitely cut it in half. Yeah. Because everybody's trying to get the old one just to get, you know, mm-hmm. some people just want mm-hmm. the style of the NPC like it's like a, a new pair of J's or something. Yeah, it must you be. You know, nice. the, the NPCs are, um, NPCs are like apparently they're, 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 they're popular again. Like, mm-hmm. producing on NPC, either like the new ones and the old ones, like people are like well, kind of going back to, like, the crazy thing is after all that controversy, controversy, controversy. Stuff blowing up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they're like uh, 1400. 1300 Why? So it's one for 12, 12, 1265 right here in Rebrand. For used or brand new, though? Oh, no, used. They're used. They're the old, this the old X. How, how much is it? 1599. How much is it? Oh, um, they don't even make, they didn't, they stopped making yeah, they just, them. Yeah, they discontinued. Yeah, 1499. So. Here's one for 1300. Mm. Yeah, if you, if you really, really wanted one, like, to, like, get a good price on it, right, right when they dropped the uh, SE, yeah. like, whatever, like, stock they had left over, probably would have, that would have probably been a good time to, uh, to grab yeah. brand new, yeah, you know? Yeah. I'm glad I didn't sell my ex. I knew I, I was gonna regret it if I did, because I was gonna for a while. I was like, ah, I don't use it mm-hmm. that much, da, da, da. but that became like my everything. So I'm glad it's I. Did. Yeah, it, yeah. It, it, it's and it's in all your videos. Yeah. Like, you always be on that track. Yeah, <laughs> like, this last I year, imagine yeah. You selling it. Yeah. yeah, but the year before that, that shit was collecting dust. I'm not even gonna lie. But yo, you wanna know something funny? Like, I like I got the 404 right. And my joint is sitting in the case, mm. and it's and it's nothing against the four four. Yeah. It's just like for me, like the workflow, for me, it it it, it like it didn't it doesn't click with me. Yeah. yeah. So for me, the four four, the way I use it, um, I use it like 
I collect that to my computer and I'll, and I'll just start playing and I and and when I play something that I'm like, oh snap, that's a dope sample. Boop, hit that hit that um mm-hmm. that that capture button. Yeah. And then like bang, I got that sample right there. Like I literally will make a I'll just make make me like 16, 17 samples like that, and then boom, I got me I got I got stuff to, to use for that right. for that week or something like that. You, you just reminded I mean? me. I believe it's logic. Don't quote me. I'm not 100% sure. You guys know I always mess something up and get shit wrong. But I, I think Logic Pro for the iPad has that. Yes. Uh, what, um, Skip Back? Yes. Yeah, I mean, I think a lot of people do have it, though. But I, I didn't, and I I was didn't like, know it was wow. on the iPad yet. That's hot. That's yeah. hot on, Skip, that's on, on iPad. That's yeah. 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 That, speaking of, that's a, a new app that came out, Logic Pro for the that's iPad. Nice. Um you got that one right yes i have it and we'll, what we'll do is we'll get into that next week and we'll drop okay, a video okay. i'm gonna drop a video on how to sample the way we would like hip-hop artists because n- I, I don't see nobody doing that right and i have figured the ins and outs and i have made it so because people use the quick sampler but a lot of people are not in our our genre of music so like i see a lot of house music you know and it's not really chops the way we chop and i have mastered it and i'm gonna drop that video next week for everyone to see like that'll be episode two for us we'll get we'll dive into logic and we'll do a tutorial right there on air to show everyone how i think i've mastered it like not to sound like (laughs) the shit but i i know exactly <laughs> yeah not to do too my own <laughs> but yeah the video you guys will see next episode next week it, it, Word. i got all because then it's tricky not only did because remember this is not the the mac computer program this is for mm-hmm. ipad so a lot of people were like ah, yeah. oh, a lot of things are different you can't do this you can't do that there's a way to do everything we need to do as hip-hop heads i got you guys I'm going to show you and break it down. Everything is just hidden in there. It's just a matter of finding it. Listen, I I saw a video uh, this week. Somebody sent it to me. It was a video where um, I think, I forget who was in the studio with uh, Mad Lib. And Mad Lib was playing beats off audio shit, right? Mm -hmm. And and people was like, yo, is that audio shit? I'm like, yeah, it's audio shit. And people was like amazed. I'm like, yo, he's just just playing two tracks. Like, (laughs) if anything, you know, that's all audio shit could do or whatever. You know what I mean? Like, uh, I mean, aside from like recording samples in. But at the same token, if I'm not mistaken, Mad Lib said he was using iMachine for a lot of stuff. Yeah. And if you ever use iMachine, you know that iMachine is not exactly the most feature packed right. uh, uh, beat beat app or whatever. So it, I, 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 I'm, I'm saying all this to say like, I don't want like it, people, it, you, if you're looking at logic on iPad and saying it's limited, look at iMachine. Right. <laughs> you know what I mean? Right. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like you could, you could really, really, so like, you can, you can still get busy. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like, I mean, you know, that's with anything, you know, speaking mm-hmm. of, yeah. Avid Pro Tools Sketch just dropped on iPad. Cheese, you've been playing with that all night, so you could probably tell us a little bit more. I've got a ton of Yo. DMs, and people are not happy with it. But I'm like, one, I un- this is Sketch. I understand why. I understand, too. But I'm like, one, they did say this was Sketch. It's, it's called Sketch for a reason. And two, mm-hmm. they're new to the iOS. Let them, you know, they're just yes. sticking the, that foot in there. So I'm not mm-hmm. mad at all. I, I opened it. I didn't really play with it. I just wanted to take a quick look. But you played with it a little, so I'll let you go ahead yeah. and take over on that. Nah, I like this Pro Tools sketch. Like, not, all right, so I got, like the, I think the reason why people don't like it is because it's it's not necessarily, it doesn't necessarily work the same way as every other door. It's non-linear. Like it's, it's all, yeah, yeah, mm-hmm. it's all, it's all, it's like, it's like the, what's that, the scene mode and Beatmaker Facts. 3? So you're literally just dropping you're um you're dropping your sequences on and then you're making you're making um you're making scenes and then you're sequencing the scene right. you know what i mean uh, um and, and, and but the thing is is that like within each like instrument that you play like the sounds in there are fire like i i like i i i messed around I, I turned it on and i was like let me see what's in here um and uh the first sound i think was like a, um was like strings or a trumpet or something like that mm. these joints sound like, from the amazing. actual instrument or from loops nah like you, you like you sitting there you playing the, the midi key okay. Okay. Like, you know what i mean yeah. like the sounds the in there are dope like you know what i mean 
And then like, so like for me, like if you're gonna call this sketch, so like guess what I did with that joint? I, I sketched. sketched. <laughs> I made me a little sketch, right? Mm -hmm. Then I exported that joint, put it into another app that we about to talk about. I don't want to, I don't want to change the subject just yet. And then I got busy in that other app. But that's what they like, said, the, you know, that was the purpose for. Yo, I'm not mad at All right. I'm And you know what? I'm let's be happy they gave it to us for free instead of being like, okay, Facts. five dollars and then mm. you're, you know. Facts. Mm. So I'm not mad. And, and on top of that, and on top of that too, they got like it's like they have like um they have drum loops in mm -hmm. there. Like you was the one you told me you was like, yo, I heard this mad drum loops in there. And so the drum the loops I seen I seen so far, it's like hi hat loops. And like so you're putting the entire like right. loop together, right? But the thing is is like Automatically, once it's in there, it's 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 going to whatever tempo your 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 song is. Right, right. You know what I mean? Like, and then like this morning, I was messing with it and I was making coffee, right? So I'm I'm like um, making a beat. I'm listening to the beat, and so I um stir the coffee up, and I hear like my <laughs> spoon hit the cup, and I'm like, oh nah, record, record. <laughs> bing 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 bing, and then I flip that joint around. And see, the thing I think that people don't like about it is that, like, so when you press record, right, it's going to start recording right then and there, unless you have the right. thing, like, where it gives you that, that one bar. Mm -hmm. But it's going to start recording right then and there. And then, like, when you go in, if, like, you got to, you kind of, you kind of got to count where you start recording mm -hmm. so you can adjust where you want it to start playing. You know right. what I mean? So, like, so, like, and, and the thing I think is dope about it, like, say, like, my first loop is one bar. My next loop can be four bars, and my next loop could be eight bars. My next mm. loop could be sixteen bars. That one bar is still gonna keep looping for one bar. The four is gonna loop for four, and and to me, I like that. I like the fact that I don't have to have every single part has to be like I don't have to like take the one bar and then repeat it eight times to make it match. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like it's 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 it always it already knows to do that. That's good. And and and, and, uh, and like I said, you 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 can get busy in that. You can you can get busy like Pro Tools sketch. Like honestly, I wouldn't be surprised if I hear a lot about. People just like just straight up making samples and, mm -hmm. and then exporting it yeah. into whatever whatever else they got. Because like the the, the one thing I, I will say that is a little bit hard to get in there uh, is uh, um you know you know me I love my eight oh eights I, I ain't, ain't no eight oh eights in there and it don't it don't do AUV three yet yeah yeah yet. Well, that's the other thing you I was know. gonna say. Like this just opens the door for Avid and mm -hmm. you know. I'm just happy they're, they're coming to iOS. That means, you know, more things yes. are going to come. Better things. It means more people. That too. More people coming. And, you know what mm -hmm. I mean? And, 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 and yeah. man, listen. It's, 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 it's from, it, I think, it, this is great for iOS. Yeah. This is absolutely great for iOS. Mm -hmm. Like, you know what I mean? Because it, it, you, or, or it's, if, if Pro Tools is, is saying, like, you know what? Hey, it's Pro, remember for a while, Pro Tools was the quote unquote stick. Yes. You know what I mean? Like I, I don't know about y'all, but I remember yeah. back when I when I mm -hmm. bought my first laptop, the like everybody was like, nah, you gotta get that inbox. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> and I, I think it was like Pro Tools Five or something like that. You know what I mean? Yeah. Back back in the days, and, and 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 that was the standard. You know what I mean? It was like you were going to studios and they were like, oh no, is it Pro Tools? You got Pro Tools files? You know what I mean? Like like you know, or, or and did not realize you could just bring them waves at that point. Mm -hmm. But like you know, but like so for them to say, all right. We gonna go and expand to this iOS world. Forget about it. That's right. You know what I mean? Like that. You know. So there's an it's, update it's that came dope. out for the um for the PC too, PC and Mac that makes it so it reads sketch now. Mm. So it's like um I think it's uh, Avid always had like Avid Cloud where you could do collaboration and stuff like that, and I'm pretty sure mm -hmm. they probably you know leverage that same cloud for like going in between iOS and mm. into the. Um, because of course you know I'm pretty sure they want to keep it in their ecosystem as much as possible. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's probably a one. You know, it get easy to hit one button and say, "Oh, on the PC," and just finish it up. You know? Because yeah. in in the sketch, they have an option for you to log in to yeah. the Pro Tools page. There you go. There you go. So yeah, you already know. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. you know? Actually, that's and and even that. I was I was just gonna say that's the only thing I did see. I went to I went in there. I dragged the loop in, heard it, and I was like, "All right, cool." That's when I hit you, and I was like, "They got some okay loops in here." And I went to save the project, and you have to make an account with them to save it. And I was like, "All right, exit," because I'll deal with that later. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Really? 
A few people even yeah. said, they asked me this morning, like, why do I have to make an account to save a project? And I was like, I don't know. I'm not avid. Just make it. Because they want you. Yeah, yeah. No, but then they'll spam yeah, you know, and they, give they, you a coupon wanna... to get it cheaper. Yeah. Like, you know how they do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I know why they're doing product. it, but you know that part. for me to yeah, explain that to everybody, yeah, I'm yeah. like. <laughs> but see, uh, but, like, to me, it's like, you, 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 like, in a sense, you kind of get what you pay for. You know you're not getting the full, full, full mm-hmm. pro tools. For free, right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, so let it do what mm-hmm. it does. Shit, we pay for logic, and we're not even getting the full logic. Cause, and it's not that it's <laughs> their fault. It's just there's certain capabilities That's on these is. iPads still, you know. Yeah, Two. Facts. Well, so you know, on um, Pro Tools has the Pro Tools. For, um, I think it's like a. I've got the, the title of it, but they have a free version out now. It used to be called Pro Tools Free, but now it's called Pro Tools something. But it's like they give you eight tracks free anyway. Mm. Mm-hmm. So okay. right now, like if you have if it's eight tracks and sketch, you could probably go right into the eight track version of Pro Tools, and they're probably like banking on you. One day you have a song, you're like, damn, I need nine mm-hmm. tracks. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And then you're like, oh, okay, got them. You know, mm-hmm. but um, but like, it, it's smart. I it's the, people that ain't grow up with them uh, yeah. cassette recorders. Hey, you know, <laughs> you know, you bounce that thing down. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Facts. Um. All right. What else came out? You just said something about another app. What what app was you thinking about? Oh. I was so well. Um, you, you you know everybody's favorite, Koala. The, uh, oh, the, not, it, it, the, the, the update. update. Koala, We've you had a few weeks of updates. Uh, Facts. The updates. We make it three. We make it three came out with an update. What was that? Mm-hmm. Well, I don't even know what um, really. MIDI updates, yes, I think mapping. Yeah, you could you could you could drop you could drop the I know I know you could drag and drop MIDI right on a pad right now. That's 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 all I saw. Um, oh and no and no I'm, the other the honestly because you know i love my mm-hmm. beatmaker 3 but the only thing in that update that i got excited for was they fixed the sample missing error that everyone always got yes i bet yes you yes and i haven't right. played but, with it but i heard shout out to jerry pizzini jerry said that shit is working good yeah I, listen i've been i've been on it like all like since they since they dropped it i've been on it like almost like probably every other day since they dropped it no problems and, um I mean, I still got a crash here and there, but I am working with an old iPad. You yeah. know what I mean? Um, but like, I, I mean, like, to, I'll be honest with you, that 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 um that 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 PTSD you get from crashing for me, like, I always I I've always been on. I save every yeah, save, yeah. save 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 yeah. save 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 save, yeah. and then I also I don't like me like I don't like I don't leave a bunch of plugins running in the um in the uh, on the patch. I Bounce put the plugins out. in. I sample them. Yep. Then I get rid of the plugins. I'd rather play audio than, than have to, to have the CPU running, you know, for for the plugins Facts. and stuff like that. You know what I mean? Um, and so, other than that, like like I mean like so I, I, it just got me back it in was, the. It was a small years. update, but you know, mm-hmm. thank God we got an update. I mean, honestly, it, it, to, to keep it apart, like, I don't, I, like the, the sample missing thing, I never, I never ran into that problem because I always save, I save, whenever I, I make a beat, beat maker three, I always save the, save the beat with yeah, all we, the samples. Yeah, uh, we, me and Jerry as well, but both of us would still get that error all the time. Yeah, really? Yeah. Wow. A lot of people. I know Jerry does because I, 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 I was speaking to him, you reason. know, about that, that mm-hmm. specific problem. Okay. But, okay. Listen, I'm happy with the update. It shows progress because that's yeah, that's my favorite app. Facts. Yo, the only thing I wish that they would add in Beat Maker Three is the ability to like those audio tracks. Mm-hmm. This, I wish you could route all the audio tracks to like one bus. Mm. Yeah, you know like a I mean? Cubasis like, mixer take... would be amazing. Mm-hmm. Yes. yes. Yeah. If you you, do, you give me that in Beat Maker Three, oh rap. my god, you know what I mean? Like. uh like me, like right now, the way I do it is, <laughs> I uh, <laughs> I just put the uh, if I, if I want to do that, I, I I literally throw the audio tracks onto the pads. Right, right, right. And just trigger them like that, and then then boom, I got my group. Copy, right there, copy, you know yeah. What I mean? But but like, you know, it, it it's I mean, it to be honest, like it's it's this we we are in a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful time. Yeah. You know what I mean? And 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 we were saying this five, six Facts, years. Ago. And it only got better. Yes. Only this only got better. You know what I mean? Like like I mean I mean, let's be real, like a lot of us was out here like really rocking hard with beat mm-hmm. maker two. 
You know what I'm saying? With Beat Maker 2, a lot of us was rocking. Beat Maker 2 was my two. shit. Beat Maker 2 was crazy. Man, if they put Beat Maker 3 on the phone, man, that'd kill everything. I'm serious. It just needs to be on the phone, man. If I could just put if they could figure I'm out, too like, old. why can't my they put 3 bad. on? <laughs> yeah, but I mean, just to be able to switch in between, like, go from phone to iPad yeah, would be the killer. I might be on, I mean, I go like, core gadget. But you, 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 I mean, it's, it's a, it, it's difficult to do, but if you still got Beatmaker 2 running on your phone, you can actually export the Beatmaker 2 file and import that in Beatmaker mm-hmm. 3. But like you, when you import it in, is you you gotta do a little work. Koala got that big for everything. Oh, you ain't mess with the. Koala I messed with thing? it for a minute. The Mix mixer. Buses. It was just mm-hmm. basically a mixer, yeah. right? Is there anything else that came in that? But well, the mixer and 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 all right. So on each channel of the mixer, you can throw five effects on on uh, on uh, on each. Yeah, track, the bus. Yeah. As well as your master track, you know what I mean. Um, and like the effects that that you get to throw on each track are separate from the right, performance. Right. Effects. So um, and so like you know you get a compressor, I think a limiter, um, phaser, chorus. Reverb. Um, reverb, EQ, delay, tape delay. Um, On top of having the EQ statue. in the edit sample as well, which is dope. And I love the way it works. It works amazing. Yes. It makes. You know what I, mean? I went in there with the old project and I opened it up and threw. I opened the mixer, and the, it, it, the update is what five dollars, five ninety nine maybe. Yeah. Four ninety nine. Four ninety nine. Yeah, yeah. You can't beat that for what it was. A, it started as a three dollar app. It's amazing, an yep. amazing sampler. I'm, I think I think uh, it, all in all, like that was that 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 was three dollars. Then they had the the, the um, samurai, the samurai stem splitter. That was ten dollars. Yeah, that was what another. This, that was ten. Yeah, but it's worth it. No, let's yes. say so. Say you go all oh, out. Oh, yeah. say you go all, all the way out on Koala, right? Thirty bucks max, right? You can smoke Not any even. MPC two thousand ever. Like any like up to the newest MPCs, Koala will smoke every one. Yeah. yeah, Koala's really good, and Koala yeah. is on phone. Yeah. Yeah, 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 and, and you should be and, able to see and it. it's also on uh, it's it's free on uh, on the map. But I, I went, they didn't that the the same update they didn't to bring the to the map. Mm-hmm. The, um, with the with the mixer, they didn't bring that to the map. But it yeah, so it's sounding was, good because I like I said, I went in there with an old project and I threw my me- my melody chops on one bus. Mm-hmm. And I love that mm-hmm. you could rename those buses like that. It's just so yes. And then the Thanks. drums on another bus, and then I had my shit on the main because I need me a limiter on that main. Mm-hmm. And I was, you know, playing back and forth, and I was like, "Wow, this shit is amazing!" And I was adding more shit, like you said, all those effects. Mm-hmm. And then to go back to the edit and and then have another EQ there, I was like, "Wow, this is crazy." But well, here's the dope part, right? Say you was like, say say like you was like somebody who like spit and made the beat, mm-hmm. right? And you were just doing like a YouTube video and you was making a beat. You could have like bus A, bus B, bus C having all your um all your uh sounds going through it. Then bus D or any whatever bus you want, they have a mic. Oh, yeah, your on vocals it now. You know what I mean? And you could let it so so you could be doing that, have your interface plugged in, have a good like fucking vocal, and then after the mic, you can still you still got four Facts. more effects to throw yep. on it. You know what I'm saying? And you could be sitting there like just just straight spitting. You know what I mean? Like uh, uh, making a song right then and there, like, or, or you, at least this, you know, you could be sketching one out, you know, like, so. But the one thing I will say, right, and this is just me playing devil's advocate, right? It's amazing to me that people, myself included, are like so amazed at the fact that Koala has a mixer when every other app like <laughs> comes with one already. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We got used to that Koala like, just being simple, real simplified, yeah, and as yeah. is. Mm-hmm. Now yeah. what? But now you can actually. What's left? Now you can actually like gain stage in there. Well, so I think mm-hmm. Koala's going to pick everything that the SB four hundred four Mark two got that's worth anything and stick it in here, because it's just code, right? The SB four hundred four is hardware, true. and they'll do some updates. But like I, when I saw this buses, I was like, oh, this is like the FX buses on the four hundred four. Mm-hmm. But you know, you got bus A and bus B. You can put a whole different set of effects on A and then on B. Facts. So you have your samples have one effect, and your drums can have a different effect. Oh, yep. Like so, then you could make the bus A go into bus B. I mean, like, uh, yeah, no, they're just, they're just, because then they have, you know, they have the um, Koala versus 404 battles already. So, yeah, like, the yeah. one thing I, I hope they, no, one thing I hope they do, though, right? The side chain compressor, mm-hmm. I hope they allow you to, um, the input to be a sample versus a bus. Yeah. Because sometimes mm-hmm. the only thing I want to side chain is the kick. Yeah, yeah. 
And so that means I have to put the kick on its own channel versus having a kick go through with all the rest of the drums on, on its own on its own channel. You know what I mean? Like or, or, or with the, the drum channel. So if I can get it, if they can make it so you can side chain from straight from the sample, forget about it. I think they would have at that point. Them. Yeah, yeah. That, I, I, it, 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 that's that's to me that's 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 like that little four channel mix is perfect. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Because it, it gives you exactly what you need. Like, um, cause you could you could just adjust the, the volume level from the sample itself. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like you get your samples, like you know minus six, minus ten, whatever you wherever you want them, and then feed them into that 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 channel. Compress them, do whatever you got to do with them. And then, and, and, and you're good to go. Like, the one thing I love about this is now you could really, I, maybe some people already knew how to do it, like, just within Koala alone, not with, like, having Koala run through, like, AUM or something like that. But I could not get my drums to smack out of Koala for nothing mm. before. Because it just seemed like everything was always getting, like, kind of mashed down. You know what I mean? Like, everything was kind of getting yeah. that like mass together you know maybe it's just the way i was doing it. I nah don't, you're right I don't, I don't you're right i had say, a few samples like yeah. that when it was it was so bad that i took the shit out and just went to a different app mm -hmm. yeah like because me what i would do with, with koala like i would literally um bounce like if i if i made a whole beat i would just bounce out bounce out all the mm -hmm. tracks that you know bounce out track by track then throw it into another app and if i wanted the effects i just throw throw koala effects on it from there so that way i, I can get the drums the way i wanted the sound and still have the, the those performance effects right. that i wanted yeah. you know what i mean but Dude. dope update good job elf audio um oh you know another update came well yeah too, i was gonna right? say what well serato oh pitch i mean serato sample not talking about serato yeah, yeah. sample it? that stem it's, it's, it's not on ios but that, that and it's clearly the best sounding stem uh separator we have heard like we already yeah, discussed this yeah. Yeah. Yeah, they Yo, got the best guys. bass and drums all day baby drum bass and drums clean. all day i've been yapping all day drum, we're gonna do yeah. a serato episode I took a, maybe you, like you, third I, or fourth I, we'll definitely I, do a serato episode because because you know the dope part about that like like See, the dope part about it for me is like something like Serato, right? Right? I'm taking taking the vocals off a song, right? But maybe it's the vocal that I actually want, and I don't want everything. I don't want right. anything else. But now I'm doing that, and I don't have those. Right. Yeah. You don't hear that wobble you know I mean? either. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's the smart part. And then, and then for me, and then like I can put it at any pitch mm -hmm. that I want it to be. Yep. At. You know Sink what I mean? Shit right up. And you could, and you could take Serato too. Like say it's like. It's like one little like you heard a you heard a a, a a sound that you wanted from this song and you want to stretch it across the keyboard like mm -hmm. you do that too <laughs> right yep. it's, it's, yeah, yeah you could also it's, do that in logic it's, it's, pro for ipad yeah a word mm -hmm. we're gonna get into all of that okay. we're gonna dive deep into logic we're, we're gonna dive deep yeah. into that logic but that serato has become yeah. my new um i literally take the joint I want and throw it in Serato and take what I want from there and then pull it right back out into uh -huh. the MPC or wherever else I'm. I was about to yeah. ask you. I was about to all ask day. you doing it like that. Since they that dropped that update, like that. that's what I've been doing all day. Uh -huh. Like yeah. that's because like that first the first beat I did on a low five twelve, I actually had stem um stemmed a couple samples out like uh like I took the uh, I stemmed the um what's that the joint um it, 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 I just remade the um the PM doing mm. beat. Oh yeah, when you sent me that shit was fire, yeah. Yeah, and and then I threw the um and I threw um the Lauren mm. Hill, the um the Lauren ooh over top of that. All that all that that was all stemmed out from from Koala. Oh, from Koala. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, stemmed that from Koala. That sounds great. Then then just sampled it in there because it's because like the because the dirt on, on the, the on the six is gonna mask oh, the little sure. uh, the, yeah. the yeah. artifacts. Yeah. Yeah, so and the twelve, out. I think, probably does a decent job at it too, because just because it cuts yeah. off that, like the high end is like way rounded uh -huh. on both of them, and I bet you it's super rounded yep. on the six. Yep, yep. And man, oh man, like, I, yo, I, it, yo, I'll tell you, man. Like when I hear people complain about like, oh, this door doesn't do that, this door doesn't, I'll be like, yo, you wow, there's a workaround right for man. everything. Like, <laughs> <laughs> you can doors for thirteen dollars. Like, mm -hmm. don't <laughs> don't don't complain, man. Like, don't complain. You know what I mean? Like, 
first Pro Tools, what that toy cost? Uh, that cost like at least like five hundred dollars. Yeah. You had to buy hardware with, just with to get it. Yeah, you couldn't even play without hardware yeah. for like the first like six, eight, ten years. Uh, we spo- yeah. iOS spoiled us because remember, even another app that dropped while we were gone. It's been out now for a while, but we've been gone for like a year. Um, knock. That mm. came out, mm-hmm. and even I was like thirty dollars, and I waited so that shit went on sale, and <laughs> then I got it because <laughs> iOS has spoiled us in prices. Decap not? Yeah, just... Decap's app. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, right. And it's dope. I love it. We'll do an episode on that I'm... too. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you. Yeah, all right. So you, 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 you gonna be the one that, to 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 make me actually like give that joint a chance because I saw that thirty dollar price. Yeah, same I was thing. Like, mm-hmm. I was like, I bet you I can figure out another way to do that. I bet you I can figure it out cheaper than thirty bucks. Yeah. I think it was uh, I was like, last I year, Black Friday, it went on sale. I finally was like, all right, beep. It was like $20. I was like, all right, oh. I could do $10 off. I'm being cheap. I could do it. Word. Black Friday coming uh-huh. Black Friday coming up yeah, soon, yeah, too. So we, we got a couple months. So I may I may end up throwing knocking. It's gonna be, yeah, knocking it's going to be some good that, sales very soon. Yeah. Yeah, hell yeah. Um, Because, you know, I'm still rocking with that FAC Transit. No, me too. You I know. love that. You crazy? There's a ton of old <laughs> apps like that I still rock with. Those are my go-to. Mm-hmm. I love them joints. Um... Mm-hmm. What the hell was I gonna say? Oh, another app that came out. It came out a while ago, but while well, we've been gone, Splat to Clat. It's a drum rompler. We'll uh, do some yeah. episodes on that. Um, tons of fucking drums. Tons of drums in there. Mm. Like, I'm not a loop type of no, girl, no, but I will take time. that loop and chop the shit out of them and rearrange them. Like, oh. you know, mm-hmm. tons yes. of sounds. Yo, and yo, the crazy, crazy thing is, I, I, I've been doing like. Like, because I've been riding a train a lot lately, and um, and I it's kind of forced me back to Koala. Like, I've been doing that with like old mm-hmm. drum loops. You know, I take the old drum loops. I'm like, oh, okay, I'm gonna take this part of the drum loop, and I'm gonna take that yep. part of that one. And then you, next thing you know, I got a snare from yeah. one record, a kick from another record. Hi hat. Hey, that's how it started. From third mm-hmm. record. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, hell yeah. And, and and that's that's the thing I love about like like like. Like stuff like Koala and stuff like that because you could do this now just like any yep. you know what I mean and, and, and you can just experiment and and you and you get you get you could get it right you can get it wrong and sometimes we get it wrong we actually mm-hmm. get it right you know what I mean like and 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 this is to me it's, it's just like nah it's it's been a great time Fact. man you know like for real it's, to me personally it's like too many options yeah I'm like how do I want to yeah. start today like what yeah. I need to make some kind of parameters and shit like okay <laughs> wait wait no you can only do this. That's why, like the Lo-Fi 12, case in point. I'm like, I'll just do what the Lo-Fi 12 can let me do. Period. Like, mm-hmm. I might take the sample track, you know, and shoot a video, you know, for these next ones coming up anyway, and just say only these two boxes. That's all I'll do today. Or this whole song has to be finished Yo. with these two. Or only iOS. Or, but, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Yeah, but like to me, you, you like it, it's like to me, like I lo- I love having all the options that I that I can possibly like have, right? And sometimes I'll be like just sitting there, just thirsting over something new, knowing like I really don't need this. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? And then, but like for me, what having those other options does is like when I see something new come out, like for example, the um, what's that joint we was talking about? The um, uh, the analog heat, oh, yeah, right? right? Right, yeah. Now, right now, I ain't gonna lie, I ain't gonna hold you. Like the analog heat that joint has has has, 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 has grabbed my eye. Like they they use two words that I love: analog and heat. What is that? You know what I mean, and it's like oh, it's a, the distortion like, box. That's what I was saying. Yeah, yeah. Is yeah, it's it's really a plug-in too, or actual piece? Nah, it's hardware. And they're saying yeah, it's hardware. Yeah. Who makes hardware. it? Uh, and now they got the analog heat MK2 uh, electron. Yeah, right? makes uh, the same people to make the uh, yeah, dish track they, and Octatrack. Okay. Mm-hmm. They so they got the analog, they got the analog heat, analog heat MK2, and now they got the analog heat plus mm. effects. So, so if you wanted to, you could get that very, very first one. You know what I mean, and and, and probably get it at a real good price now because they use I think each one of the boxes like nine hundred dollars. Mm. You know, but however, me, I'm like, yo, mm, do I want an analog heat or do I want to just take that four hundred four I got and put it behind? What I already, what I already have, and use and use that in a way that I think the analog yeah. key will work. You know what I'm saying? Like, like, you know what I mean? Because I don't know what the analog key exactly what it sounds like or what yeah. it does, so I can't yeah, miss exactly. it. Exactly, same thing. Yeah, yeah. I don't know what it is. You know, mm-hmm. so, so like that's, the, but that's to me that's that's the advantage of having like options. It's like you like, oh, I need this, but then you sit down, you're like, wait, but actually I got this, yeah. I can do that, and and this and this and this. You know what I mean? Like, you know, it's just it's just about kind of like. For me, like kind of like just just trying mm. stuff and, and being being okay with okay, yeah, I messed that up. 
well, let me take this piece out the out the mix. Let me put this piece in, or or just let me take this one piece out and just see how it works now. You know what I mean? Like you know, and like Brassa, just just you know, saying, you know what, I'm only using. Yeah. A and B today, you know, because I mean? it can yeah. get overwhelming. And, and, Even me when I come in here, like oh, I didn't really cook up a lot this year, especially this summer. So when I did come back in here, it was just like looking at everything, like okay, where the where am I starting? <laughs> yeah, like, me too. Yeah. Or it's like pl plugging a bunch of shit, like plugging the wires, and yeah. like okay, let me make a setup, or any of that, take the whole shit down. I didn't even make a beat. Right. Yeah, I'll tell you what. So the one thing that that like this this like always saves me on that. Op one man, like oh, you that's, love that your brought OP me back one. to music for the same thing. No, but it's, it's like so enclosed, like like it's just a closed mm -hmm. system. Like the pocket operator too. Like okay, I have this. Mm -hmm. I'm on the bus. Mm -hmm. This is all I'm doing. And then I can take my phone and sample anything I want. And I'll just try to get creative with what I sample. And then when I'm chopping, the chopping is real finicky, so I'll get like as close as I can get. But then you like put it together, and you're like, damn, this product is all right. Or at least I made something and, instead of kind of like playing around with wires and, and redoing updates or or. You know, now I have to update my whole computer because I want this one thing to happen, mm. or, or you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You know what came out too since yeah, we've been yeah. gone? You just reminded me, Bri, that mixer from them. That little oh, the TXX. Yeah, you got to yeah. show. Yeah. Ah, that's oh. just a beast. Ah, oh, come on, <laughs> you bro. definitely. Yo, oh, they, got, they got a bunch of updates <laughs> on it too. That shit is. Right, you definitely yeah, yeah. got to do an episode on that joint. I will. I will. They got synthesizers built it, in. They it, got a drum it's, machine built in. It does BLE MIDI. That's, it's it's super sick. It's twelve channel. That's what I was yeah, about to yeah. ask you. Twelve channel in and out to um, iPad and and it's an audio yeah, interface. It's twelve an audio in and interface, out right? to iPad or phone or PC or Mac. Mm, that's lovely. Nah. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, the two I just built can't in do the price channels. tag. I ain't gonna lie. Nah. It's a lot. Exactly. So so <laughs> the updates. I mean, I can't. Wasn't that shit more than our whole test cam, I think? It's a boutique product. I'm not going to say it's not cheap. I'm not, I, mean, I get it. It is. It's definitely not cheap. That's but a good way to put the it. The last update. product. <laughs> oh, it is. It is. It is, for sure. I mean, but um, the last update that came out made it so much more, um, uh, it, so much val more value added is, is what I can say. What? So what, like, what, what did, what the did they add? The 12-track um, um, in and out at the same time. Yeah, I can't lie. 12 tracks. In and 12. out. 12 a 12 in like interface like yeah. this big like i can't lie like like because remember i was going crazy with all the uh with all the with all the with, with, with my po 33s mm -hmm. like that right there would be perfect for it because like because running one po into the next mm -hmm. one to the next one by the time you get to that last one it's like you can't even like you can't like you got to do all of like the the you got to try to like well maybe let me make sure i put this snare at this velocity mm -hmm. oh yeah, <laughs> you know yeah, yeah. Well, you can mix them all and then you have you on know. each channel you have um eq compression you know mm -hmm. you have two buses effects i mean it's like it's really a full feature mm -hmm. mixer but it just looks tiny but the tiny is a feature in itself so it's like yeah, when you yeah. see the price tag, you're like well <laughs> what if this is big like i have the ssl6 too right and the ssl6 costs maybe 200 bucks more and mm. it's a way big mixture it's made by ssl they have a big mm -hmm. long history i use the mm. 2x6 more than the SSL, ssl6 and then having them mm. both is crazy because i'll use the ssl6 for my npc live coming out but then i use a tx6 for my npc live going in mm. so i can have 12 things going into the npc to sample yeah and then it's all mm. my keyboards all my synthesizers i can let the mini be wireless or bluetooth or whatever and then I, you have a whole system right there that's fire Bro, I got a whole playground over Too much there. stuff. That's what I said. <laughs> yeah. Too much, man. I can't even make a beat. I'm over here being a science, mad scientist. <laughs> Garage Band came out with an update too. <laughs> yeah, you were saying yep. that. I, yo, I didn't even know it was up there. I just opened it the other day to mess with. You, you know what? I messed with the drummers in there, and I thought they had that, some new drummers. I'm reading oh, it now. I'm, I'm, I'm not like really it. sure, and I'm not really seeing what was updated other than sounds i see a ton of sounds came in some lady gaga shit came well, in like mad different artists came in with sound packs and i don't really mm -hmm. see any performance update though on here maybe i'm not looking in the right place i mean the sounds is to me that's the sounds is is, is, is all i need like give me some new sounds you know what i mean like like and not to say the old sounds is bad but like i love yeah. new sounds especially if you're gonna give it to me ultimate 808 <laughs> it looks like it might be some sounds on here that are new yeah it's, it's a lot it's a lot of it's a lot of um i know i know the drummers they had the new drummers in there like I, they had a lot of dudes in there look like you know a lot of a lot of hipster drummers it took nah, wait, Quest Love. Oh. Nah, nah. oh <laughs> no, I, no, I meant like uh, 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 Quest Love type. 
um, they'll be like um, the question drummer. <laughs> drummer with questions. <laughs> Ahmad. <laughs> yes, no, 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 no. Ahmad Thompson. <laughs> Bigfoot. <laughs> Nah, but nah, but like, but like, but even at that drum, the drummer on on, on Garage Band, yeah. like, I'm only thing I, I'm mad you can only have two drummer tracks because I wish I could get like four. In oh, there I didn't even know that you can to, only have like, two. Doing open? kicks, one. I didn't know that. Boom, bad. One is because you know, but you know, you can have you can have one drummer doing kicks and snares, yeah. other drum drum doing percussion yeah. and hi hats or however you wanted to do it. I tried this I mean? stuff out though. Or you can have two. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, yeah, like it, like it. <laughs> Most people be mad talking about oh, everything you everything you export from uh, GarageBand is normalized, and I I don't really care. Like uh, I, I'll fix it or not fix it, but you know I'll make it. I'll, it sound it, it sounds fine to me. I haven't made it. I haven't done anything where it sounds like sounds mm-hmm. bad. So yeah, you know. So normalized or not, it all, it's also like perfectly like curated too. Like all those sounds, they're right. Like, like, yeah, you want it normalized. Like, you want it to go good to where it's going. Like, Apple's not dumb. It's garage yeah, band. It's right. not logic. Come on, man. Mm-mm. This right. is for yeah. like your basic your right. people learning. Uh, like, you don't want to give somebody like a, a engineering job to do when they're trying to figure out their first beat. Mm-hmm. You're absolutely right about that. I still You're don't see. Right I'm I'm that. reading. I don't see anything else. That I see was Maurice. Updated. Oh, oh, oh. The drummers, not more. Yes, yeah, so get more drummer sounds. <laughs> yeah, but he's like, <laughs> okay, wait, let's see. Track girl. Oh, what was oh, the one she said? She looked sound. like Rich James. <laughs> it was a Oak girl, Felder. wasn't it? <laughs> oh. <laughs> I remember one episode we was talking about it, and he was like, "Yo, she looks like Rick James." But I think she probably has. She probably has some dope. She probably has some dope drums. I think. I think that one because they had one drum. It sounded like uh, one drummer. She sounded like a uh, like it sounded like a Sheila E record. Mm. You know what I mean? It had all that like and the, percussion uh, and stuff, you know, timbales, like, yeah. timbales yeah. and all yeah. that. Yeah, man, listen, that, that those that, those I take the mm-hmm. kicks out of that and then, and high pass that, and I got me a nice little like Back. percussion track to go in the background. You don't even, just, yeah. something that just keep that just make you you know you, you people hear it. They like I don't know why I want to dance. Yeah. And it's like exactly. you don't even need. I wouldn't even put high <laughs> ass on that stuff. I just let that I just kick snare eight away, and that's it. Mm-hmm. And that's it. Like keep mm-hmm. on rocking, yeah, man. You can't beat that. Damn, I don't know. Something else came out. An app. I'm... Or an update. What was it? Mm-hmm. I think another update came out for something. We said Koala Garage Band Beat Maker. Logic came out. What else? Let me go through my recent ones and see. Recently updated. Yeah. Yeah. Animal Animal Z was in September. Yeah, mm-hmm. and that's free. See, I'm behind because I didn't even know that. I mean, I think it's, I think it's, but I think it's free. But with like, you could buy, you could buy. You, you, there's an in-app mm-hmm. purchase. Oh, this is minor improvements. Mini Mog, um, Model D, same thing. Minor improvements update. Loopy, no, we talked about one point one. Oh, the huh, update. The update. Two days ago. One point one significant update. Oh, see, Full uh, list of changes at roadmap. Loopy Pro. Multi-track audio, built-in headphone port, uh, Bluetooth advertising, um, rename MIDI sources, color swatches, nudge. They got nudge in here now. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. No, go look at this. So when you go to the um, updates and it says like what it is, you have to scroll for like two pages. Really? Yeah. Mm. Wow, I didn't even know Luke right came I'm out with updates. This is like the le- the month of updates. Two days ago. Just two days ago. Yeah. Yo, let me tell you, Loopy is one of the most, if not the most precise looper apps I've ever used. Like, that shit is dead on, no mistakes. Yeah, that's good. And I haven't used mm. it in a, in a while. Like, I haven't really sat and used anything in a while, to be honest with you. But when that shit first came mm. out, so I could imagine how fire the updates made it. Yeah, I never used Loopy. Uh, I was judging. Them circles I turned you off. Yeah, <laughs> I, so I, I see people I using it, like, and I'm like, I, I've used it before. It don't, yeah, it don't, it don't, it don't work for my head. It's still kind of that's weird. How, I need wait a minute, that's, right a, that's how I felt about that Pro Tools when I opened it and saw that scene pattern looking mode. I was like, oh man. Listen. As soon as, as soon as you told me you know, it was more of a looper, I was like, all right, cool. Like, do you have, like, I was, already, but, like, because I was messing with it, and then like, when I went into edit, and I was like, oh, you could just edit where the loop starts. Yeah. I was like, oh, okay. I was like, I understand why, I understand why this is throwing people off, because it's not, it's, it's not, like, it, it doesn't really, like, 
I've, um, I started on a program just like that. I forgot the name of it years ago, but I remember one of these computer programs, I started with the program just like that. So it, it's familiar to me. I could go in there, you know, and I already know how to work mm -hmm. it. I just don't prefer to. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I mean, because I mean, like we, we like you said mm -hmm. before, we got we got spoiled with the prices, but we also got spoiled yeah, yeah. with the features. Yeah, yeah, I'm a linear kind like of. Like a lot of these joints, they already yeah. they they yeah. they drop they drop everything mm -hmm. right where you want it to be. Like you said, Loopy, it's boom, it just drops it right yeah. where you want it to be. At, you know, it's just I mean? a different so, type of sequencer. That's it's like the biggest. It's like so customizable. You need to make your custom go back more to like a normal thing before yep. I can use it good. Yep. You know? mm -hmm. Like another piece of hardware that dropped was that um that, that poly and tracker oh, mini. Yeah, right. Did you get that? Yeah. You got no. the big You one. got the regular tracker I though, right? About it. And they updated yeah. that one? Yeah. Yeah, I haven't updated my joint yet. I haven't used it. That's another joint just sitting yeah. in the box. It's just been sitting there. I love that yeah. joint though. Like, cause just for the simple fact that it's got the radio on it. Like I, I that one I got that one I really need to like start bringing around with me. Cause you get you get power that with a um with a USB hub. You know what I mean? So like that, I, if, if, you know, I, that would be dope to me, like sitting apart and just fucking, uh, you know, well, not now because it's like, it's about to be cold, but you know what I'm saying? But like, it, like I can just sample from the radio, like, like that and the, um, and yeah, I was going to say that like, 404 is my take, take outside joint yep. just for that USB powered. Sure, and and you can say like, I just take my iPad, my 404, I sit outside and I could get all my samples and power it up right through that iPad. And just sit mm -hmm. that iPad on the mm -hmm. on the you know on the side and work on that mm -hmm. 404. I love it. Yep. That my 404 became an interface to move shit back and forth, literally, because it's so yeah. easy. Like yeah. I, I'm going That's from good. computer yeah, yeah. to NPC to mm -hmm. iPad with that shit. Yep. Yeah. Yep, you don't you don't have to do like no airdrop right. or nothing like that. You like I plug it in the computer, boom, and, 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 and like I'm I'm recording, right. and boom, and drag and drop. And my and thing is, I love the effects on there, so it's not just the interface. Yeah. I'm throwing my effects on the shit first, so it works. Yeah, yeah. tiny, like the three, portable. The four four is like it, it's it's a dope box just because like, like you said the effects on it, and it's just like. It could be so many different mm -hmm. things. Like it could be your box that you make beats on, but it might just be a box where you just collect yep. samples. You know what I mean? Like, 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 you know, like. I said before, I had a 404. I had the 202, right? And and like to me, the 202, like because it has no sequence or nothing on it. Like I was just using the 202 just to collect samples, and then I would record the samples. Into right, right, else. right. Yeah. You know what I mean? And then all of them joints kind of have that same, like the same way the NPCs all have that similar like kind of mm -hmm. work work workflow to it like the the 404 like the you know the 404 tools 202 and the 404 like there's, there's something yeah. very similar about the two of them you know what i mean and 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 then and like for me like like i was like all right well this is how i use 202 so this 404 is, is really just a 202 just on 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 just like with some growth yeah. hormones you know what i mean like 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 crazy you know so but that's for me yeah you know? I know. Not yeah, I feel you. Really love that. I know exactly I do what that. you mean. Uh, you know. Make a beat by layering, like just make like an off beat by layering. You take what you get on that, and if not, just do it again. That type of thing. It's all right, mm -hmm. man. But it's like that. Like every every four or four is like immature compared to NPCs to me. And I started out on NPC, so it's like hard mm -hmm. to use that sequencer and say, okay, I'm gonna cook up on this. Now I, I agree if the effects are a one. And then moving stuff around, mm -hmm. like the whole hardware box part of it, and that removable media and all that, that's excellent. I'm not mad I got it. I'm not going to sell it. But, um, yeah, I won't use the sequencer. It's like my main drum programmer, you know. Yeah. Not for, not for nothing, but like, to me, like, like, the, like one of the great things about the 404 is if you can get it in, if you can get it right on the outside of, 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 of your master. So that way, like, whenever, at, at all times, when you're playing, you got that skip back sample. Yeah. Like that's to me that's the that's the most clutch feature. Like you know if 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 it's in, if, if you get that right there, you know what I mean. Like if there's nothing, even if it's nothing else, it's like oh man, that was so dope. Damn, what did I just play? Oh yeah. wait, boop, hit that button, bang, it's right there. You know what I mean? Yeah, you can't beat that. Yeah, you're right. That's mine. Yeah, you know? you're right. You can't beat that. I want to say quickly before I forget, we're giving away a free sample pack with this episode, so. Everyone click below in the link. All you gotta do is like or subscribe to the video or both and you'll get a free sample pack. Yeah. Curated by WeSampleEverything.com. I know I know um 
I know what's the name. I know the uh, audio kit drop those. Uh, they drop those video games. Yes, out. the NES. Not video games. I said you know. the NES. SNES. Yep. Yeah. yeah. I was right. SNES, the SNES sim, mm-hmm. yo, I, yo, I like that joint a lot. Like, let me tell you, that it, if if you have it, open up the Mario Kart, uh, the Mario Kart Crash, uh, plus that's the name uh, of the Mario Kart patch, press patch, yeah, yeah that's Mario that. Kart Crash yeah. patch, and just go and just just uh, bring it up a couple octaves. You got you a dope snare slash hi hat. I didn't get that one. Mm-hmm. So you don't mess up, like, does it sound better than, um, the wait, Core Gadgets? Yo, wait, 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 you don't... Mm. So you know Core Gadgets, they their um, video game emulator thing. You know what I'm talking oh, about? Oh, no, I don't like, I don't like the, the, alright, so the, the video game joints and gadget, like, so the, they got, they got a, um... It's like 8-bit. <coughs> they got the, a video, they got a, yeah, like a, like a, um, like a, almost like an NES yeah, synth in there. Yeah, it looks whatever. like an arcade, a little, yeah. It's, yeah, it's, it's, it's cool or whatever. It's just like it's it's just kind of hard to get the sounds out of it that you actually want, but you can get some real interesting sounds. I like the SNES synth because it's like you got like you almost have like video game sounding presets. You know what I'm saying? Like already, and and I know the gadget has presets in it too, which are pretty dope. Yeah. All right, yeah. so thank you guys for um, tuning in. Next week we're gonna dive into how to use the sampler and sample in Logic Pro. That's Download right. that sample right. pack. And if you make a beat with them, mm-hmm. tag us on Instagram so we could check them out. Yeah, Hit got, that like, subscribe. Mm-hmm. And, and, and we got some, app, and we got we got uh, we got a couple of uh, promo codes for SNEF sent to give away. So you know. Oh, so, you gonna give them away so, now? Yeah, you know, maybe we. I mean, we, we with with the they they throw a nice beat together. We maybe thrown to to the person who, who whoever the beat is the, uh, the best you. one or the one that, that we that we that we like. We don't want to say mm. best. All right, so this this turned into a whole contest. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So download the free pack below and um, tag us and yeah, the best the, the beat we like the most. Cheese is gonna give you guys some. Uh, how many? What, you got one? Sunny, yes, sir. I think I got two or three. I gotta go look back in my um in my uh in my DMs because he, he definitely sent me one and he just been sitting there. He said do with them. Okay, what so you we'll want. figure yeah. it out. Like, it, right, cool. Uh maybe first place, second place. It is SNES. SNES. Okay, I thought I was saying wrong. From Audio mm-hmm. Kit, shout out to Audio yeah, Kit. Love what you guys do. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so uh stay tuned for, for next week. Same time, same place. Logic Pro sampling. And if you guys wanna see anything, Please. any specific app or you want you have questions and or you want us to cover anything, leave it below in the comments and we'll try to get to it. Okay. All right. Peace. Sure. All right, y'all. Peace, peace, peace.